IFC, or Industry Foundation Classes, is a standard, some would say the primary standard, for open BIM data exchange. IFC is commonly referred to as an exchange format. This is not entirely correct. Firstly, IFC is a schema, not a format, but that's probably a discussion for another time. Let's focus on the exchange part. The current IFC workflow doesn't support data exchange to the extent that I can start modeling in one software, make an IFC export to another application and continue modeling uninterrupted. It's more accurate to think of IFC as a means of referencing or archiving model content. In the previous video of this series, we presented IFC as the PDF of BIM. Like PDF, an IFC file is a frozen copy of the original content. It can be viewed, measured, used for clash detection, cost estimation or simulation and innumerable other uses, but should not be edited. A typical IFC workflow could be the following. An architect creates their design model and exports an IFC version to share with, for example, the HVAC engineer. The HVAC engineer can reference this file into their own software and use this for coordination. More than that, the engineer can also use the IFC model as a basis for analysis, example, energy analysis, which is pretty impressive. The IFC transports enough information for the simulation software to read and analyse the spaces in the referenced model. What the engineer can't do, however, is make a change to that reference model. For example, if they want to move a wall or create an opening in that wall for an air duct to pass through. In this case, they must request the change from the architect. The architect, back in their own modelling software, then cuts the opening in their model and issues a new IFC file. It should be said that it is technically possible to edit an IFC model, but that's not the intended workflow. Almost all software that import IFC treat the IFC model as a referenced copy of the original design. Some tools do allow you to make minor edits to an IFC model. For example, splitting a concrete slab element for construction phasing. But this is really a, an isolated activity and doesn't have any effect on the original design model. The point is that in an IFC based workflow, each discipline remains author and owner of their model content. 